Hi, and welcome back to Geek Space TV. I hope you had a very refreshing break. I know I did. There was much conversation, a little bit of plotting, um, so, several laughing at screenshots that are great. Um, thank you for tweeting at us and sending us wonderful pieces of art to look at. Um, if you're ever not sure, I believe we use l hashtag LeviathanDS, not LDS, because that will give you a very different <laughs> hashtag. Um, at least that's the one that I track if you ever want me to see it. Um, with our eyes and ears. Wait, what? Likewise. Oh, likewise. I thought you said with our eyes. <laughs> wait, wait. Eyes? I? I'm I. Hi, Kika. Uh, <laughs> hello, and welcome. Geek Space TV is a non-profit streaming studio based in the Seattle area, and we are very glad to have you here. Uh, if you would like to help support the stream, you can do so in one of the best ways that you are already doing, which is being here and watching. But sharing out the stream, tweeting it, hosting it, all of those things are wonderful and helpful. If you are able to do so, uh, donations are also incredibly appreciated. We are a nonprofit studio, and it is one of the major ways that we pay ourselves and our people here. Uh, and Can you do me a favor and yes. tell them what kind of nonprofit we are? <gasps> Super nonprofit. Like what our goal is? Or at least tell them that it's pulled out. <laughs> Oh, the goal for for Being the profit. Why we're a nonprofit? Oh, why are we like, a nonprofit? Yes, I'm gonna like try to remember our mission statement, which I don't entirely remember. We want to make inclusion and all that fun stuff. They're great words. Diversity and inclusion in the gaming oh, communities. <laughs> I haven't memorized your mission statement. I'm sorry. You might need that on an email. I suggest you take a look down below, though, because the information on our Twitch page is gonna be much more succinct and eloquent than I myself am. Hi guys. Someone's in <laughs> trouble. <laughs> so much it's Lauren. <laughs> Lauren and Joel. just like ping me over and over again in Discord and be like, read this, read this, read this. Um, I I will try and memorize it. I've only, I've only memorized like one mission statement in my life. Because I was going to get quizzed you, on it. You don't need to memorize it. Uh, but I make a note. For. It's really weird to see <laughs> Lauren in trouble. That's what I was <laughs> now, I'm, I'm going to stop the crowd if I should be excited or worried. Right now. Oh, look, it's in chat now. Our goal is to make an inclusive environment. <laughs> Here, I got this. Our goal is to make an inclusive and welcoming channel that works within gaming and geek spaces to promote inclusivity and diversity while keeping you entertained by the genuine geeky passions of our cast members in areas such as tabletop, RPGs, VR, and many others. You're welcome, Lauren. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, you're all wonderful people, and I truly appreciate each and every one of you. If you would like to donate, thank you so much. If you can, uh, you can also check out our Patreon for more regular monthly scheduled donations. Uh, with that, let us briefly reintroduce who our cast of characters and players are, just who you are and who you are playing. Uh, let's go. Let's go in the opposite direction with our newest member. Hi, I'm new. Uh, <laughs> I knew. I knew. <laughs> I'm Blue Jay, um, and uh, I'm playing Rachel Lucas. I am a uh, badass lady. That's yeah, that's yeah, yeah, that's yeah. Right. pretty much. Yep. Yeah. Got it covered. Hi, I'm Shell Game, and I'm playing Thea. She's a uh, bit of a roguey character who will give you sass and steal everything you got. Uh, I'm Claudia. I'm playing Kika, and Kika is our baddie engineer. But there's been nothing to fix. So I fixed the fight <laughs> by making us try again. <laughs> so we're going back into battle, guys. I'm a meter tall. I have wings. They have not helped. <laughs> Who's the bold? I'm playing Ziana, also a lady badass. Uh, and I am Random Tuesday. I'm your GM for this Stars Without Number uh, space opera themed show. And we're going to jump right back into combat. Our, uh, our crew of the Batleth have uh, landed on the planet Duranga. They have contacted and started speaking with a Rachel Lucas, who is going to, um, with the help of her, or direct them towards her husband, if, with, to help them acquire uh, some space weaponry for a very large ship. Uh, however, one of Thea's old friends we use air quotes, uh, has accosted them and is now demanding the return of their life savings, uh, which apparently was not very much. I didn't know it was their life savings. Well, we, but does that make it okay that you stole it? We definitely yeah. had juice and burgers. Like, they yeah. were real burgers. They yeah. were real burgers. Yeah. Like, real meat. With actual, not like, soy. cheese. With real cheese. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was drippy. Mm-hmm. 
the juice was fake. And I believe that puts it at Rachel's turn. Awesome. Oh. Having just heard, fuck it, we're staying. Oh Kill her. So there's a part where like she's listening to what's happening. She's like uh, peeking up abo above the bar. She's still got her pistol aimed at the back of this uh, person. And um, she... Part of her is like, oh, damn, I'm not going to get my bar tab paid because obviously I didn't handle it. And then she hears, and then she hears the like, nope, we're going back. And so she's kind of smiling a little bit when she fires again. Uh, I think I'm going to like you. Um, I got a 16. That'll hit. Okay, I hit. So that's great. Um, and I'm using my thermal pistol. So that is... Eight damage. Okay. They take a solid hit and uh, <laughs> he just says, fuck it, we're staying. Uh, and he gets shot in the back. And uh, I definitely like look down to the bartender for like that one, that one hit. Yeah, that one was good. Yeah, we, I did like a thumbs up like that. Yes, <laughs> Thea goes, still wanna stay. Um with that, uh one of his lackeys is going to stab at Thea. Mm -hmm. Um and I believe a 17 will hit oh, you. Oh yes. Yes, it will. So you are cool. Going to take uh, six points of damage. Okay. Uh -oh. uh, you would see her getting injured as well. Right. Um, and I have remote. You have the remote repair. So okay. I don't have the are. book, so I'm not sure how that works. Okay. So that's you're going to have to help me yeah. win my next turn. That's around. totally cool. Um, <laughs> so close and to dying. <laughs> how close are you? I mean, I'm Do seven points away. If I oh, get I was like, one are you glowing? Time. Are you blinking yet? Like, beep, um, like she's yeah, definitely the, like. This is like the, like red. Uh, if you had a your overlay, like your HUD is like red ringed on the outside now. Mm -hmm. Y'all uh, make it so hard to tank for you. Wouldn't like, like oh. it be <laughs> lucky if like our I don't know our our like rogue told us that she needed help? One of them, seeing you having no no longer on the t under the table, is gonna take a shot at you, um, and they're gonna hit you. Oh, that's bad. Uh, for nine points of damage. Oh, that's okay. Um, and uh, this is the first time I felt this going way. to shoot at you. Uh -huh. No, no, it's not his turn. Uh, one yep. of them, the one who was stabbing you, is going to stab you. Because there's four minions, right? Yeah, there are four mm -hmm. minions. Um, and they are going to hit you with seven points of damage. And then the last one, seeing you fire a shot at his leader, is going to take a shot at you. Uh, does a 15 hit? Yeah. I don't remember what you're seeing. Okay. I only have the armored undersuit. Oh, that's right. Okay, and mm. you're only going to take four points of damage. Okay. And that's going to put it at Ziana's turn. <sighs> he feels like he's got numbers on his side right now. So, uh, Thea is <laughs> very clearly severely wounded. Probably, probably looking a bit rough. Mm -hmm. So, um, uh, she is going to, Ziana turns towards one of the lackey minions. Uh, the one who just most recently hit Thea. And turns and swipes her sword at him. Fucking. Well, I'm gonna reroll that, actually. I'm gonna use oh. my. Uh, That's an auto it's success. It's an auto. Oh, auto you success. just hit! Uh, auto success uh, on that dude because I am not gonna miss a damn minion. <laughs> uh, for eight damage. Okay. I think it's Did also you, plus well, your Don't you add your strength? strength? Oh, nine, oh. ten damage. I always forget to add yeah. my strength. Yeah. Yeah, yeah you have a I'm so strength. strong. Um, <laughs> which these guys are, are really not so strong. Um, they so are, strong. they are fairly well wounded. They're like, <laughs> Step away from her! But I, but, but I'm following orders! Um, follow them out the door! And <sighs> that puts it at, uh, Kier's turn. Kier is going to see that he has... You are in front of him, but you are nearly finished off. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so he's going to try and take a shot at Wait, you. Wait, no! I thought because I was like, you're not going to hit me. And then I was like, no. Oh. Um, I can't just um, get, like, I can't. But stop. he's going to miss. Oh, good. I was like, can you? Just, he's like, uh, and uh, just as, like, Ziana cuts in front and takes down the guy who is behind you, his shot goes wide. Um, Thea, like, tries Thea. to think of, like, a, something really good to say, and instead she just looks at him and she just sort of like spits because there isn't a whole lot left. Can I speak? <laughs> Stop spitting! <laughs> yeah, take cover! <laughs> <laughs> that you can like, definitely yell. <laughs> Thea looks at you and she's like, 
Why? Because <laughs> I'm your captain. Oh. Oh. And Mia like stops and she looks at you and she goes, "Yeah, shitty one." And she takes a swing at. God him. damn it! <laughs> Roll it. <laughs> Sorry. No, you're not. No. <laughs> It, no, you're not. I am a little sorry. Thea is sorry. Yeah, sorry. Thea is not. Oh, I do. You're stabbing. Stabbing. Oh, oh, oh. Hang on stabbing. a second. D20. Which one do I do? Oh, no. I'm, I'm going to keep using this one until it shines. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, 17. That'll hit. What's the damage? Um, yeah, it's too bad no one has any uh, Space Mountain Dew here. Oh, no. It's two. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. Because okay. it's a uh, D6. Oh, it's the knife. It's the knife. Uh, you stab him for two points of damage. Yay! And he's like, Ugh. <laughs> Ow! So you you. What was your first clue? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> Kika. You've just been shot at. I'm in pain. Mm-hmm. There, I, I, I'm going to do a like drastic, like, there's gotta be a security system in this place. Like, come on. Yeah, it's Rachel. <laughs> <laughs> when do it's we go? The shotgun behind the bar. When do we get to go to the place that's completely, like, the first place where I could summon monsters with my mouth? Yeah, that went great for you. <laughs> <laughs> Remember what those monsters did? All I mean, right. You could, like, spray them with a hose full of liquor. That would be great. I am going to pull oh. out. Like I have, I have. I mean, like I'm gonna. I guess I use my bow again. You still have a bow. I'm just not good at it. Like I'm not built for this. I'm gonna use a bow again. <laughs> Your way of firing that bow. Is what a flesh <laughs> the muses oh, me. Oh god. Roll it. See, you need to put it in the gym. Put gibbet. it in the No! <laughs> put it in it's gonna learn! It was a two. It's learning that it's okay to be a shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah! It's okay to fail. It's no. learning that! It's uh, Rachel. <laughs> okay, so I think that. By the way, there's just arrows everywhere. Like, just arrows are just in everything that does not. <laughs> I think that like she she hits her shot like right be- right between this guy's shoulder blades, and then she looks past him and sees that she's about to like die, and so there's like a, uh, but they were gonna give us money, and I kind of already chose sides, so yeah, I'm gonna use the remote repair. Okay. So that is uh, your line of sight and. Um, you expend a point of effort, so okay. that yeah. will come back like after you've had a rest. I got it. Um, she'll take a point of system strain, which is just kind of um, showing how much uh, healing you can take. I think you've recovered all of your previous system strain, except for the two permanent you have Perfect. from your implant. Um, and the what is what's your what's your level in biosionics? One. Kind of one. Yeah, because you upgraded it once. Yeah. Um, and then how, what's your wisdom? Uh, plus one. Plus one? Okay, so roll two, um, roll two d10. Two d10? Yeah. Sick. Spare the rod, spoil the dice. Mm-hmm. No, I'm right now massaging all my good feelings into it. <laughs> uh, that's 14. Okay. So she will take 14 points in healing. I need to double check. We had to change the Ooh. dice because, um, we scaled the hit point dice, um, right. differently. So I'm gonna Three. keep Three. it at two. <sighs> Sarah, to you, is saying thank you. Thea spits again. <laughs> Who taught try you this? Spit on? She, you, you she tries spit, spit a on lot. Here. Like, that Do you have any more spit? Too. Or are you like an oh, at this blood. point? I think it's like half blood at this point. Yeah. Well, it's I like, mean, also it, it, oh, well, not anymore. So now it's actually like you spit, spit and it's just spit now. Yes. Yeah. Oh, or or do you produce ink and this is just ink? No. No. She's actually part octopus. Are you very intelligent creatures? I didn't realize that's where that was going. That's okay. Um, <laughs> or witches from the Roald Dahl book. Whatever one you prefer. Mm. Yeah, but it's definitely, like, the way that... Sorry, going back to the fiction. Um, the way that Rachel heals is more like she just feels bad for you. Aww. And so, like, instinctively, there's this, like... She's not intentionally trying to heal you. It's just, like, she looks at you and she sees you look really shitty. And she's like... 
she's in over her head. And then there's this, there's this like un, uh, un instinctive uh, expenditure of energy, which heals you. It's not like I am healing you right now. Oh, Sophia it's, wouldn't necessarily know it was her. No, neither would Rachel. Honestly. Okay. Yeah. Okay. She I just mean, sort of does it. Thea wasn't spitting at you. She was definitely spitting at Cure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm just saying yeah. that it's it's it's, it's like, very much instinctive. Yeah. I like that. It's like, oh, I feel so She's bad like, for you. And then Aww. you just feel better. <laughs> pat, pat. Um, which is actually probably where it started before she got like the distance one. It was just like pat, pat, pat. Oh, and they poor actually dear. felt better. Yeah. Aww. Um, all right, the uh, the various lackey minions are gonna go. One of them is like, it's just following orders, and it's gonna hobble out of the room. Um, the one that uh, Ziana quite brutally stabbed <laughs> at. Um, they are it. they are gonna go. Um, so that that's, one down. Thank goodness for one Ziana. Down. Um, and they're just sort of like hobbled yeah. around, trying to there avoid their, their boss's look. <laughs> uh -huh. um, the one who is shooting at you is going to continue trying to shoot at you. I don't actually get to roll damage until I roll to hit you. Um, oh, fuck. Why does it hate when it does the, like, I'm going to roll out a number you want, and then I'm going to roll back? They uh, miss. I mean, you did steal it from some Girl Scouts. <laughs> I, I, I did. So it's a very ordinary die. Like, sometimes it rolls really well for me. Should sacrifice some Samoas to it. I know. Some Thin Mints. Ooh, I got to crush up yeah. the Thin Mints and then, yeah. like, bathe it in <laughs> Thin Mints. Mm -hmm. um, and, and I don't even like Thin Mints. Um, the other one... What did you say? What? That's because Thin Mints are garbage. They're no, not. I don't, come at me. I don't like Thin Mints. Tackle Mars. <laughs> Tackle Mars. Samoas are delicious now. Samoas They're are disgusting. the best. Samoas are the best. You're all wrong. I will <laughs> eat a... Not that we like Fight Girl me. Scouts, you know, but I will eat a box of Samoas for dinner, and I've done it multiple times. Because <laughs> I'm, I'm an adult. And then I get a migraine the next day. <laughs> but guess what? I'm an adult can make that choice. So uh, the one who is stabbing at you is gone. Uh, the other one is going to still stab at you because you are a big target. Um, ooh, I don't think a 12 will hit you, will it? No. Um, and the shot at you, stabbed at you, um, shooting at you. Okay. And 14? <laughs> yeah, I hit. Okay. Oh, sorry, well done. Uh, five points of damage. I I'm not gonna yuck out your yum yum. You are allowed to. Good like, job. Are you okay? <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. I'm just Me, trying to talk while swallowing. Us not liking uh, thin mints leaves more thin mints in the universe. Exactly. For you. You're allowed to like whatever Girl Scout cookie you like. They're a great organization. I'm personally biased. Please support them. Excellent. Moving on. It is now Ziana's turn. <laughs> All right. Ziana is going to. As certain individuals <laughs> seem to be Spitting most intent <laughs> on going down in a Bon Jovi approved blaze of glory, Ziana is going to position herself between Thea and Kier. Okay. Um, and as she takes another swipe at Kier with her sword, uh, she. Uh, growls over her shoulder, will you die just to spite me? Yeah. I mean, yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you'll hit. Six, seven, eight, nine damage. Do you, you remember to end your strain? Solid. I did. <laughs> <laughs> you did. Well done. Uh, actually, that is just the right amount. Uh, you take the last swipe at him with, was this your hand or your sword? My sword. Your sword. You, and, and then you end up like dragging the jagged side across and he sort of like <sighs> splits open uh, pretty, like it's a nasty slice and just sort of doubles over um, and like kind of whimpers in, in surrender. Um, are you trying to go for the kill? Yeah, fuck okay. Uh, you uh, and you get like a sort of backslash, and as he as he he had his chance to walk out of here. He did. Uh, <laughs> he did, and then he was going to. <laughs> uh, and you get like the last bit of his entrails spill on the ground. Gross. And, uh, uh, sort of collapses, clearly bleeding out. As he collapses, uh, Ziana hollers into the bar. Who else will face me? Everyone the other, stands up. The other <laughs> members who haven't left yet, like, are sort of, you know, put their put their hands up and just sort of like back out of the bar. Um, one of them like pauses and like looks like maybe he's gonna drag uh, Kira's body out, and then just like sees your face and just sort of backs away. It's like, mm, nope, never mind. Fuck it, he's dead. Um, Thea's gonna take any credits that he has. 
He has like none. Ten. Okay. Like he's got like nothing. She's very yeah, she just like on takes him. that one like guck stick and yep. she's like Hope that wasn't your life savings too. It was. It probably was. <laughs> it, probably, it probably was. It was gonna pay for his funeral. Well um, then he should have died. And at that point, like a couple of people at the bar um will like come over and like just sort of like drag the body outside and like throw it in the garbage where bodies go on Duranga. See, I definitely like look at the bartender and I'm like, that that mess part, that wasn't me. I don't that I'm not. Um, but your tab for this month. Yep. Before oh. they drag him out, Ziana does clean her sword off on his shirt and then puts it back on her back. And with that, we will drop out of initiative. Wait, I need us to fire the arrow one more time. I believe. I need, to, I need to make sure this is. I've been rubbing so no. much luck, good luck in <laughs> no. this. No. But then we're we're going to no. You're welcome to fire the arrow. I do not do it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to roll. Are you rolling to, are you shooting the arrow? Do I get a roll if I don't shoot the arrow? No. I mean, you can. You can roll, roll the die. die. You can roll at any point. You, <laughs> you don't have to you can, wait. You can roll the die. I'm going to save it. I'm going to save it. Because it's got to mean something. I'm not going to make a do a really trick and party. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not going to do a trick and party show with a dice. They're special. It's getting really close. Uh, okay. Put my bow away. So... You, no, uh, it's just not you put your bow away, <laughs> you clean off your sword, Theo, what do you do? Um, you look at the bartender, yeah. get your tab taken care of. And oh, then... after I took the guck? Yeah. Oh. And then Theo just stands up and she's like, she's kind of confused about why, how she got healed, because she doesn't really fully understand that, because she was like, that was definitely, I mean, like, like, do you poke at it? Yeah, she's like, there's a hole in your shirt, like, that didn't get fixed. She's like, oh, I liked this one. Sorry, it matches the other hole. <laughs> so she's just, she's just sort of like, how injured are you? Uh, right now, I'm. No, like, it's Ziana. Oh. I'm fine. I'm functioning. I'm good. How does she look? What did she say? How does she look? Uh, oh, she looks mostly good. I have 21 out of 29. Oh, so. Yeah. She yeah. looks pretty, pretty okay. I did a good job. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She this looks, is also pretty really confusing good. for Z because you definitely did not look that fine when she leapt into the fray. <clears throat> Thea's like, I told you I was fine. <clears throat> See, I got this. Even though she is like, no, she just. And like, I like saunter out from behind the bar, and I'm like, uh, looks like you guys have a lot of business here. Uh. Not anymore. It's all cleaned up. Is so. it? Is it all? <laughs> As the body's being dragged across the floor, <laughs> smear of blood behind it. <laughs> all cleaned up. So you know, like the general rule here is, mm -hmm. you when you when this sort of thing happens, you don't make a mess. That's why we all have blaster pistols and not fucking whatever that thing is. It's a sword with like a gut it's a river. So You're. I got you. I got like standing up, like bleeding. Listen, <laughs> like in front of me, like, like on the table. <laughs> so you're, you're human height. Yeah, you're on the table. She, if she used a normal blaster, it would literally just, just, just. You, your hand is so strong. I do would, not use blasters. It would just do break you in your use hand. Mops, because this place is a fucking mess. Now. Do we have business to discuss? Or are we going to venture further down the path of janitorial duties? Hey, I understand that we made a mess, and obviously that wasn't the intent. We were just trying to survive. What will I take to cover it? Huh? It's not my bar. Like the bartender will What's the policy? Is it like one of those? Clean up after yourself. So we have to use them. Okay, we have to pause our space adventure to clean the floor. <laughs> this is a cleaning montage. <laughs> the like bartender we... hands you a mop uh, and a bucket. Uh, I do the whole thing where I carry the bucket. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm literally I'm like so... not doing anything because I was using. You know, a thermal pistol that he cauterizes. Like, the yeah, yeah, no oh mess. Oh my god, very Z intentional. Uh, mm. Them's They're the rules. <laughs> if we're gonna do business together, you follow the rules. Don't are leave you behind the mess. Are you honestly making 
business with you contingent upon my mopping the, the floor. The bartender <laughs> certainly is. I am. I don't this, care about I'm the a regular here. The bartender is the one that gave me the like. Yes. The aggressive. I'm like I'm not leaving. Yeah. I would sit at the are, bar and like. We drink understand. And be like, you so. you mop. I'll drive. I have like a oh, little are you guys mopping? Yeah. Excellent, because Diana was not going to do it. <laughs> so basically, I like address you about using a messy sword, and you're like, the whatever. And they're like, yeah, I did not begin the fight, but I certainly ended it. By Juthia and Kika are mopping. I assume like Kika has like rags on all fours. Yeah, yeah. Like, I'm, dry, <laughs> I'm dry. I'm the dryer. No, it's the like I have one rag and I'm running. There is now like, just one really clean path through the bar because you only clean up the blood. Yeah, course. come yeah, on. Yeah, the rest yeah. of they the didn't say we had to clean. No, no, no. Just, just, just the just you blood. clean up your own mess. You just clean up your own mess. They're all the rest of it remains sticky and disgusting. Okay. I would also yeah. like to use my first level healing to just stop myself from bleeding. Yeah. Do you have a lift patch? You want to? I'm um, not lift. Um, Lazarus patch. No, lift, sorry, lift is the one you want to um, nope. heal you faster. Nope. Okay, then you can... I have uh, a meta talk. A, me a medic kit? No, I got a meta talk. M-E-T-A... Oh, medic... Meta tool kit! That's not for people. That's for ships. <laughs> okay, my, my printer was bad. Uh, no, I, have, I, have I, have I have a med kit. You have a med kit. I have medicine skills. Roll... Roll your heal and, and intelligence. Um, and intelligence. Thea doesn't say anything when she hands it to you. She's just like, I got four. Uh, you stop yourself from bleeding more. Um, roll one d four. That's so funny because I have biopsionics, but I don't have heal. <laughs> three. <laughs> I'm just like, I get three heal health bar and the health okay. pack. Yeah. Huh. I the just am like, you're gonna have to like take an actual break to recover. I'm trying to think um, of how I, I'm like, oh, like oh, biopsionics and like. Stim patches are the only way you can heal quickly, really, other than like patching up and getting a small amount back. No, it's fine. I just wanted to make it so I didn't bleed on the floor that we just. Yes, you have stopped bleeding. Yeah. You have staunched the bleeding. Excellent. You take out the the, med, the the tool at one point and just like. It's a cauterizer. Yeah, you so I'm like, cauterize like, like, it. <laughs> this which is a smell of burnt hair. Yeah, because I, I have all. I have it is very furry. There's some sweet, sweet scars. So like sometime after like they start cleaning and you're not cleaning, we probably fall into a conversation where I'm like, eh, that works. That's how captains get it done. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Delegating by simply refusing until someone else. <laughs> That's pretty much actually how our entire crew works. Being, yeah. being sassy until somebody else does it. <laughs> Uh, do you two want to converse at all, or should we wait until I like, until it, it, like it happened? Like okay. we were just like small talking over like some kind of space food. This is better than the grain alcohol with the Mito Sticko cinnamon straws. Thank the Lord. Um, this is actual <laughs> like it's like the equivalent of rum, but it's probably all synthetic. I mean, if this is my regular bar, then it's, it's not shit. Yeah. It's, you know, it's drinkable. Won't it's have a whole mixed. lot because she needs to keep her faculties around her when there may be more bellies that need slitting open. Uh, but uh, she does. She does have a little bit uh, to be, you know, personable, um, or at least attempt to be. What else are you gonna do? Standing in a bar watching exactly. your friends clean the floor? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, They'll finish cleaning, yes. um, and at that point, the group can reconvene. Perhaps we should have this conversation elsewhere. Yeah, you seem to have worn out your welcome. Uh, see you later. Um, please don't hate me. <laughs> I cleaned up. I hate this bike. Uh, and Ziana is also, like, quite injured, but, I mean, you know, straight-backed and fine. <laughs> totally fine. Yeah, totally yeah. fine. Yeah. You'll take them back to uh, kind of wherever you're based out of right now. I kind of assume you guys probably don't have a fixed location. No, no. Um, we we probably have like some kind of pseudo like Airbnb basically. <laughs> um, so it's like you. It's Airbnb. Yeah, it's not a hotel. Yeah. You just live in some someone's vacated apartment for a while. Like <laughs> I've got connections. It may or may not have been vacated. <laughs> <laughs> but you're paying someone money for it, so it seems legit. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. So you, you head back there. Um, Deckard will be there, and he'll probably yeah. be like finishing up some sort of some sort of deal. Um, like come over and be very sweet. Like, oh, it's good to see you. Did you uh, get into a fight? What like, is you're bleeding? I'm, 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 the, there was. You know, the bar. Oh. And who were 
Is is Deckard like tall, ruggedly handsome, maybe like dirty blonde hair? How did you know? Some slight Continue stubble. Just curious. Just curious. <laughs> Strong jaw. Nail on A little head. bit smarmy looking. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. He might be a little, little scruffy looking. Yeah. Like, scruffy yeah. looking. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely scruffy looking. Yeah. <laughs> a little. Yeah. So um, the the place we're Stuffy at is it, it's like I'm 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 guessing that all of the places in the city are a little bit run down. Yeah. Um, so it's a little bit run down, but like um, Rachel herself, like it's clean, like it's probably actually been cleaned, um, and it's very much like we usually do. Like we have several locations where we bring people to do business, but I'm not taking you guys to another bar because I don't trust you around people. No, that's fair. Um, <laughs> we are murderers. Yeah, and since I don't actually like live here. Sure. Um, no. Yeah. So I take you back and I say like. The sword? The thing? Yes. Stays. I'm not a thing. No, not you, not you, the bow, the thing. Oh, the, I don't know. It's a bow. It's just a bow. You're like, what's a bow? You fire it weird. Weapons. Oh, stay, yeah. Stay at the door, I, uh, right? This is my house. Well, it's not my house, but it's the house that I'm living in. Ziana will remove her sword and place it on the inside but yeah, by the fine. door. That's fine. I just don't like this. This isn't a bar. There's it no is strangers. Your home, and we will respect that. I mean, that. she will kill you without it. It is she your home, try. and we will <laughs> respect that. Right. Uh, anyway, uh, you you wanted to talk about weapons? Yeah, we need some rather big ones to go on a ship. Um, Thea passes over a, a compad with the specs that they're looking for. And I like just like immediately <laughs> push it across the table to Decker, and I'm like, "This is you. These I'm are... gonna, I'm gonna go get another drink. Do you want anything?" Talking to Deckard. Uh, the usual. Okay. All right. And like she like she just like does that thing where as Helps she's getting up milk. from the table, like as she does the thing where she's getting up from the table, he's looking at the compad. And she like squeezes his shoulder and then like goes to the other room. These are. Not insignificant specifications you're looking for. No. These are military grade. I was told you could get them. If we're in the wrong place, I mean... No, it's not about getting them. Uh, let me... And he, like, pulls out another compad and, and brings up some information and kind of looks at it. Looks like I've got something uh, matching your specifications uh, and hands you back, like, a, a sort of brief... Those work for you, and they're within the range that you were looking for. Yeah, the hands them to keep going. We're all have to read it to around. <laughs> Thea, Thea like looks at her, and then she like goes meep meep, and uh, reads her like all of the right. specifications. That makes Thea. sense mentally. mentally. I mean, uh, so he's basically offering you kind of two different kinds: one that's designed for use against like armored vessels, and then um, one that would be used against like fighter type vessels. Um, so two, two well, different weapons. Kind of similar to what the Batleth has, essentially an upgrade of those weapons. Uh, I'm going to immediately take that information, like recall it, um, and this can work with organic materials as well. What? Meep meep. Are, have we not told him that we're working with organic materials? Meep meep, we're not telling him that. <laughs> meep meep, we definitely don't want to tell anyone on this planet that we're trying to meld some sort of organic materials with a weapon. That is... Like, as you guys are, like, looking at each other and not saying anything, like, Rachel walks back in and she says, that, I know that. They're talking. That's what that is. They're are they psionics? <laughs> There's those, like, like, like Trico psychotics. Okay, you're definitely not psionics. Whatever it is, whatever implant, if, do you need me to leave the room for a minute? No, we're like, good. No. We're good. Um, meet me, I give you all, like, I give you all, uh, a summary of all the stats. That's super do awkward. Want, do you want a big gun? <laughs> so, how is uh, the bar? Did you a, win well? Do you want a mini gun? I mean, I'm assuming that we went over all of this yeah. with Ariuta before yeah. we left. So, so, yes, we want what we specified we wanted. Yeah, which would be both of them. Like, Oh, yeah. cool. Yeah. Um, it's not, it's not okay. It's both. We want both. All right. It's a million each. <laughs> you know, I understand that there's a lot of work that goes into these things, and I am willing to compensate for work, but that's exorbitant, and I don't like getting stolen from, so... <laughs> 
I'm just... <laughs> you would know he's definitely highballed the price. Oh, yeah. No, I mean, that's yeah. how you do. Yeah. yeah. Wait, I would know Wait, did, that. Did, your, did Rachel I was, laugh? I, yeah, Rachel okay, laughed okay. at yeah. you saying I don't like being stolen. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes, whoa, whoa. very reasonable after everything they went through. <laughs> Look, these parts that you've specified aren't even close to that. Like, yes, it's military grade, but only parts A through F. G and H you can pick up on any old ship past three generations. I'm sorry, you came to us. Yeah. Uh, I would like <laughs> both of you to roll me uh, trade and charisma. I need to get trade. I don't I really need to get I trade. I don't have that. Can I use fix? No. <laughs> Can I use talk? No. It's <laughs> trade. It's trade. This is, this is trade. This I mean, is, if you use them, you will get very different results. Five. Oh. Five. Ten. Ten. Oh, wow. wow. It's not the D20, but you know. You have a very impressive knowledge of military grade weaponry. I assume you have friends in Ica. We're not talking. We, we, sore subject. Okay. Mm. Uh, but right. the answer is yes. I can do uh, 1.5 million for the two. Meep, meep. I don't know. That's good. <laughs> I don't what know about anything about prices. I don't know about prices. <laughs> okay, it's a uh, down. Liz asking GM, yeah. we don't have you that don't kind have of money anywhere, anywhere near. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't like have anywhere you, near that. You would need the price if you pooled all of your resources, yeah. you probably have to wouldn't sell the even left. get to half a million. Yeah, you'd have to sell the bat left. Uh, and we're not. Uh, 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 I'm sensing this is out of your price range. We can install it ourselves. So. Is it? We're this not. For the installation, I assumed you were installing it yourself. I'm assuming the price you're quoting includes acquisition. Yes. What if we were willing to do the acquisition ourselves? Then I can offer you, well, Depends on how risky you want to go. Do you know about the graveyard? Yeah, of course. Everyone knows about the graveyard. <laughs> Some of us don't know about the graveyard. Uh, Thea probably has heard of it. You definitely know about it. I mean, so, that's where we get our shit. So. Yeah, it is. It's where you get your shit. So, um, the graveyard is a hole in thread space, a uh, rather mm. nasty tear that uh, is within short distance ship drive from Duranga. There's a reason Duranga's here. If you make it to the graveyard, there's a pretty good chance you'll be able to salvage something for yourself. If we make it? Well, who else do you think is going there? <gasps> spirits. We've handled spirits before. Not in this territory. I mean, I, I have, but we as a team have never gone to if it's a risk you really want to take. <laughs> what are the alternatives? You pay me 1.5 million guck and I get them for you. Uh, I mean... Or... I mean, you'll be here for a while, right? Are you really that bored? Yes? Really? You want to go into the graveyard? Literally, all I have been doing is gambling and drinking and talking with Mike. And Mike is annoying. Yeah, he really is. Yeah, like I'm like I get that you've got work to do, and I'm totally fine with that. But just like I don't know, go to the graveyard. It's not safe. It's there are spirits. Okay, well it's not safe here. There are also spirits here. We have a really good track record of making it out alive. I don't. You just saw it. I work. literally I can't, don't. I mean, I, you. I can't stop you. You are your own person. I, what type of horrible human would I be if I were to stop you from doing what you wanted? Not one that you would be married to. No, no. I'm just. If you want to go with them, you're. I'm not saying I want to. I'm saying that that's another option. Of course, like less than 1.5 million gucks, but as a guide. What would you want in return for your services? Money. Quote us. What's a reasonable price? I, I don't know. I, I quote you. Do you want to write it down? I quote you a table. price that is reasonable for someone guiding you through very dangerous space. Uh, like, like uh, something that we could potentially afford? Yeah. Um, Probably so, some like back and forth negotiations. Yeah, where you get down to a number that you would both agree on. Oh okay. yeah, Thea definitely negotiates whatever number comes out, even if it's a great. I price. definitely hold. I, good. I, 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 I hold over your head the fact that I just saved your asses back there. <laughs> what? How? I just I say it. But like how? Like how did you? You were behind a bar. 
Like you shot, I shot like five arrows. Like, I'm sorry. Uh, actually, I'm also a little curious about the uh, about the logic on that one. How did I save your asses yes. by shooting that dick that I had the one nothing that I against? Oh, oh, so it's only the final blow that matters, right? Right. Whoa, 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 whoa! Look, we need someone who's got some sort of knowledge and level of getting into the graveyard. I have never done the run myself. Otherwise, I would say I could do it, but I haven't. I'm not arguing against it. The price that you've negotiated is reasonable. You seem to be quite skilled with a blaster, and that is a skill that we are currently lacking in our Yeah, crew. I know. I, know I have that. a... I, I mean, you have a rifle. I do have a rifle. I mean, it's at the door right now. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen you use it. <laughs> so that's Sarah, sorry. <laughs> that was Liz. It works for you. I, if you acquire it yourself, I have no need for any fees. Except for mine, obviously. All well, right. I mean it. it. Yeah, of course. Um, then uh, perhaps as a uh, gesture of goodwill, we could attempt to also retrieve something that would be of interest to you. Certainly whatever you bring in, I'm sure I can find something to sell. Oh. Oh. Uh, at a, a reasonable split of profit. Naturally. All right, then. I am nothing if not fair. I would very much like to not leave a planet with more enemies than we had when we landed. I don't know so, why it me when you say that. Uh, this sounds like an acceptable bargain. All right. Um, so with that, uh, you're able to begin your preparations to go. So you probably want to head back to um, the back left. Um, so to, to be clear, so the graveyard is... You said it was a tear in thread space. That would be like a space space place, right? Not like a... Yeah, so it okay. is It is within... Um, you don't have to thread uh, there, which is the like faster than light travel, because if you did, you might fall through the tear. Um, they will also point out that uh, ships don't tend to leave that like when they fall through the tear, they tend not to be in good shape. Often that kills a large portion of the crew. There are explosions. Um, but so we're essentially is, salvaging in you're space. Salvaging. Mm -hmm. So you're salvaging in deep space. Um, it is outside of the solar system, but it is within a like a short distance travel. So it'll it'll take you some time to get there, but you don't necessarily want to take the risk to get right. there. Um. And you would have some information on like when, um, what has been happening recently, because a lot of people are really interested in that spot because it's a great place to salvage. So mm -hmm. like people track and know like when a big ship has fallen through or, or come out and like what's there. Um, there's a lot of word on the street about things. Um, so you'd be able to do a little bit of information digging to like know it's a big area. Okay. So like where to approach from? Can we before we like leave? You don't need to leave right now. Can I? Can I? Well, I mean, like before whatever that happens, can I like make a like a connect and something else roll to find that valuable information that'll help us out? Yeah. Like, give us advantage. Um. On so what, what? How are you gonna go about finding that information? Um. Talking to my contacts. I'm, okay. I'm a fixer, right? Um. So I'm going around to the places where I've been. Talking to like um, the bartenders and being like, yeah, I'm about to like leave. Have you heard anything recently? I mean, of course I'll be back. Like, I don't need to pay all of my tab right now. Right? <laughs> There's a lot of like, oh, uh, wait a minute, you're going no, to the no, graveyard. No, no, no. Like... Deckard's Deckard's thing. It's mm, like so. Right. So there's... put it on Deckard's tab. Yeah, <laughs> do that. Um, and yeah, so I'm I'm just I'm look, talking to my contacts and, and looking for. Uh, that like okay. advantage or whatever. Uh, go ahead and roll connect and uh, charisma. Okay. Oh yeah, wow. twelve. Very nice. Um, so it takes you a little bit of time. You spend maybe a, a few hours kind of walking around, going to different locations. Um, but you're very thorough. Like you know who mm -hmm. to talk to. You get like one little tidbit, and you can kind of use each piece of information to pull out and tease out more. Um, so you get some coordinates. You find out that um, pretty recently there are two ships that were kind of on the, the larger scale um, in the sort of freighter class um, 
cruiser class that would have that that would be much more likely to have the type of weapons that you're looking for. Mm -hmm. um, they're not in the exact same spot, but they are. They probably fell through kind of roughly together. Mm -hmm. um, they seem to be the same type of ship. Um, and so uh, a lot of scavengers are kind of on their way there, so it'll okay. be riskier, but you have a pretty higher chance of getting the things that you want. Right, cool. Um, and then you also know like kind of an older area that would be like lower risk, but maybe less likely to have the stuff that you want. Okay. So yeah, I do like my gathering and I stuff all my very limited stuff in a bag and come back to you guys like where you said that your ship would be. And I'm like, what do they? What does she see? Yeah, what do I see? <laughs> <laughs> or uh, can I ask to our, our decorators? We, we <laughs> haven't. We have not touched the outside because nope. we've been giving our own fight. It got scrubbed. Yeah. Remember, I yeah. scrubbed it and retouched it. There is no weird paint on my ship. <laughs> but we have there, a fighter that we get to paint. It's inside the cargo bay. Uh, but the fighter but the, is not on your ship. It's no, it's on the it's, yeah, it's, it's on, on the, the, the Leviathan. Yeah, the Leviathan. Uh, so the Batleth uh, is a Scrappy ship, it's a bit on the, a bit on the older side. Uh, a little bit of a, a bit of a piecemeal. You can identify various parts of other kinds of ships that have been used to repair the Batleth through its many heroic travels. Mm. Uh, it has recently been uh, cleaned of probably there's still little flecks of paint on it that weren't quite well scrubbed off, uh, but the, um, the uh, 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 serial numbers and the, and the name of the ship are all recently touched up. All right. So I look at the ship, I'm like, are you sure you haven't been to the graveyard? <sighs> Oksana, open up! Hello, Captain. Captain, you have one new message. <gasps> And from who? From Hexy. Oh, uh, uh, Thea, if you could get, sit, I'm going to, I'm going to my quarters. Uh, all right. What, actually, what is the message? I want, just want to hear it. We're in the room. <laughs> wait, no, no. is it Thea, like, wait. leaves wait. the room. Right. She's like, wait. I haven't wait. listened is to it? this message, Captain. I thought that would be an invasion of, your, invasion of your privacy. Oksana, that shows a really unusual and appreciated amount of restraint. Oksana, by the way, is our AI on the ship, for those of you unaware. Yeah. Uh, she's a little sassy. So I definitely asked, sassy. like, is there another crew member? No, that's, that's our AI. Uh, this junk heap has an AI. You'll learn. Right. Hello, my name is Oksana. I am the artificial intelligence installed on this ship. I am running beta version and then lists off a series of numbers. We, we installed a personality protocol in her once. It went a little awry, but I like it. Anyways, uh, I'm I'm going to I'm going to the, the bridge. A small amount of sentience. I'm going to the bridge uh, to listen to my message. Okay. Um, Very quickly, she just like. Like marches. And, like, and you said that you skedaddled too. So I'm just like standing yep. there with Wait, this. Where did you go when you got on the ship? Oh, no. As soon as she was like, uh, as soon as she said that she needed the, that there's a message and that it was from Hexy and then that you were going to read it out there, like Thea just left the room. Okay. She's, she headed to the cargo bay and she crawled up into for, the finished. For like a second, it was definitely like a, oh my God. Rachel. It's, but no, it wasn't him. So yeah, like you skedaddle and you skedaddle and I'm left standing with like a meter high bat. <laughs> yeah, but I have questions. <laughs> <laughs> there, there, there was like fencing that is put on the side of the wall so I can actually like climb on the walls very easily and I could be at your height very quickly. Okay, well, but like the thing is like, uh, uh, just wait, it, this happens a lot. <laughs> on board the ship, the ship itself, it is uh, 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 nicely situated, you know? It's very lovely it's, inside. It's very much like uh, the Firefly. It's got like kind of a long corridor with like people's this, rooms off of it, and uh -huh. then it goes down and there's like a two-story cargo bay at the end of it, and then the bridge is at the opposite end, and like engin engineering would be underneath the cargo, like. There are three rooms. bedrooms, and also there's some funky paint, I think, in the cargo hold. Oh yeah, yes. what does the cargo hold look like if you- Pika? Are you taking, are you taking Rachel there, or no? Uh, no, I actually want to talk to her at the door, uh, but yeah, I, like I, I'm where, trying where, to pause. Like, there's like an entrance oh, in yeah. the hallway. So there's an entrance, yeah. and if you go and to the left, there's the bridge the and right. a couple uh, bedrooms, and if you go to the right, which is near the back of the ship, there is a large 
two yeah. floor. So there's like uh, a cargo, cargo bay hole. door, and then there's a side door. As okay, well. so we went in the dog. side door, not yeah. the cargo bay. Okay. Um, and then underneath the main floor is the engines, which that's where Kiki usually hangs Got out. Got it. But um, no, I, you are connected here. Um, and you know that spirals work on a different frequency than most acceptable. Spy yeah. what? Spirits. Oh, spirits. Yeah, I need Space to get a message. Uh, so you, you, there's got to be someone here who knows how to send a message to... Want to send a message to spirits. Just one. To a specific spirit. Yeah. I mean, I could help, but Why? Like he just makes that face like, you don't need to know. <laughs> no, then no. The answer is no. You gotta speak our language. I don't, I, I mean like- Or give her a reason other than a face. <laughs> <laughs> and she like, she goes, she goes as if like, she goes as if she, she, she turns around as if she's gonna go like walk out and make like a punctuation to the statement and then realizes she has no idea where yep. anything is and she's like, where mm-hmm. I know somebody who became a spirit and I'd like to keep tabs. And they didn't give you a way to contact them? We had a fight. Oh, is it one of the kids? <laughs> oh, baby, here you go. Is it one of- <gasps> So the GM wants me to help you. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> what? Keep gonna say it out loud, whether you help her or not. I mean, <gasps> I'm trying to get my, 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 my big. My big notes. Oh wow! My big notes. Wow. Yeah, I have a lot of emotions. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it's it's a small ship. It's definitely in this or next of the arm of the galaxy. Someone of your caliber should be able to find someone who could find someone who could pass a message. I mean, like compliments are nice, so keep them coming. But like, honestly, do you want a story or do you want some guck? Or if you give you, I, I, I mean, enough of either. <sighs> Talo Tarka goes by Talon now. <laughs> he just jumped a couple of ships, so it's gonna be hard. I got a lot of guck. What can you do? With just a name? Yeah. Or point me to a spirit bar. I'm Someone not did. pointing you to a spirit bar. I'm great at this. <laughs> <laughs> That's not happening. I know better than that. Um, do you have any idea what ships he's been on? Do you? Can you give me a physical description? Can you tell me like some way that any kind of thing that's special about them that I can he's, use to track them down? He's a trico. That, what? That's what yeah. Okay. Yeah. He's a little bit gray on top of the ears. I mean, that's what people tell me. I don't actually know. You don't know. You've I never. can't see color. Oh right. Right. Uh, I haven't. It's it's cool. It's it's fine. Um, How common are Trico? Pretty uncommon. Okay. So yeah. That they're, would make it automatic. Yeah. He's, he's gray eared, yeah. mostly mostly yeah, white like his dad. They're pretty uncommon. Um, like they were basically like most of them are still on their primitive planet, and then some of them got. Taken off world, okay, and became <laughs> we became we became little settlers, right? All right, not gonna ask too many questions. He was getting in a bad habit of shaving his neck fur. If that helps, <laughs> <laughs> but that was when he was a kid. He would just like cut it down so that he could handwrite. It was weird. It was... You know, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna judge the, the hygienic. <laughs> Practices of a species I don't understand. Um, I'll I'll ask some people, right. but if it gets dodgy, then maybe also some guck. I mean, like, and she like goes into like one of her apron, like not apron, I guess her little like baggies. Oh, wow. She's like all bag and she like pulls out like a like a guck stick and like just like just just like she's hanging on the wall. Like, <laughs> right? Yeah, I'll take it. Yeah. <laughs> Someone hands me guck. I'm not gonna like. Right, well, let me show you the cargo bay. <laughs> okay. We got cots. Right. You get a cot. Excellent. She can't, can't go in the cube? No! <laughs> the cube, by the way, the cube has been locked. 
There oh, are, there yeah. are no Sophia walls. Could, no, I made the walls. Yeah, yeah it's done. She'd finished I finished it. As soon as I Wait, finished so it, there's a lock. Sophia can't get in it? I mean, I mean have, you ta- have you talked to a kid? about it? No, she hasn't. Then okay, no. so Thea didn't go there then. I mean, well, you, I mean, you went there until the very end. And, like, Thea found can out. pick locks. But would she? But would she? Yes, she would. <gasps> yep. Okay, um, but like, yeah, so I'll also roll for this. Cool. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, go ahead and roll. That would probably also be uh, connecting charisma. Okay. Um, to kind of get a message out there. If you want to pick the lock on yes. it, please. Um, uh, I, we're going to do this as an opposed yes. test. You're uh, going to roll your fix and intelligence, and you're going to roll your dexterity and... My fine dexterity for yeah. my alien? Uh, your alien dexterity with either fix or sneak for, like, a picking lock. Oh, okay, so... Okay. how you approach it. I got a nine. Nine. Okay. You feel like you find pretty easily, find some people who know some people, um, give them a message, and they're like, yeah, eventually someone will be like, I heard, I've seen one of these like weird little bad people, and that's weird. I say something to the person when I'm like, when I'm talking to my contact away from like the ship yeah. away from Kika, I say something about like really weird looking, like there's some, there's some kind of like belittling, derisive comment. That's fine. Yeah. We're, we're used to it. Not, we shouldn't be. We are. Twelve. Fourteen. Oh. It's a good, you, here's the thing, you know Kika's locks. You yeah, know it's not just one lock. Locks. Oh, that's so true. So you, you like do the first one and then you hear the ding, 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 of like the second lock engaging and you know that. And then I'm like, yeah. Oh, and she just starts using fingers. her fingers and yes. then. It's just like fucking lockpick fingers. Weird. Uh, Which is. Finger. You haven't even seen the eye thing yet. Ugh. She got an implant last week, weird. so her face. Is <laughs> her face is weird thing. in the game. She oh yeah, in the game. Oh yeah, now I can just like hold my yeah. hand over walls and I can get information. Cool. Yeah. She can remote hack. Um, okay. Thea locks the door behind her. <laughs> you lock the door. After she like, you, you are in the the cargo yeah. bay. Uh, the cargo bay is interestingly painted. Yeah, tell me about that. Uh, there's like <laughs> handprints along it. There's some fish near a set of la- like. Equipment. Um, there was looks like there was like a fire in here and s'mores, and no one's cleaned that up yet. Um, I forgot about the s'mores. There's definitely like names written in very like preschool. Ass- it looks like a preschool room has been painted on there. Um, yep. Nice. By the way, in the box, yeah, a room has been set up. Oh. All the stuff is there. Okay. <laughs> Wait, all of Conrad. Conrad all stuff of is Conrad in there. Stuff mm-hmm. is in there. Thea just like. Wow. Sits in the middle of the floor and she just sits there and she pulls out her compad and keeps like <laughs> trying to learn the language. Ah, how's that going? Uh, Ziana, you go to the bridge. Very awkwardly and very quickly. Uh, and then sits down. He's like, okay, uh, Oksana, play the message. Playing message. Ziana, Z, it's Hexy. Hi, it's been a while. I'm sorry I haven't been in touch. Um, I, I'm not sure when you're going to get this, but depending on when you get this, um, I figured you would be going to Duranga at some point, and I'm, I'm in the same system as Duranga. I'm on the other planet, actually, and we're, we're going somewhere, well, I'm with the Eratos, you know, but she doesn't really like to fight, so, um, we're going to potentially be in a situation that might involve some fighting, and I know that you're really busy and you have a lot of stuff going on, but if maybe you were able to take a moment and come see me, and she names off the planet that she's on, um, in, in the system and sends, uh, like, coordinates with it, I would, I'd really like to see you. Okay, bye! End of message. That was, that was, that was Hexy, I'm going to be in danger. That was Hexy code, she's talking to us on it. That's Hexy code, for she's going to be in danger. I would agree with this, I've heard it before. <laughs> okay. The origin of the message is from within this system. Okay. Okay. Ah! All right. Uh, uh, uh. She turns on comms to the ship. J- j- ship meeting in the cargo bay! Uh, I How stay good. where I am. <laughs> I assume there's comms in every room before we were psychic. And I click there, we're like, we're here. Well, two of us are, two of us are here. 
Are you Diana, boom, 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 boom. Can she boom, hear boom, it? How soundproof is the cube? I mean, you, did she hear uh, that? Did you hear that? Of course yeah, I did. Okay, in the room okay. Too. So Thea's like, <sighs> and then she like climbs out and like climbs down, and then she like locks it behind her and she climbs down and she's. Just... What? Let's see. Like, Kika takes the key, just chucks it, like, not happy. <laughs> what is happening? I don't have time for this. <laughs> Hexy is in danger. I, crew member. I have, she is in the system. I have to go. They, 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 they. It, that I is. I don't know what you're doing with your hands. None of your business. Okay, <laughs> let's just be clear. We all know what's happening in this ship. It's too small. You, we will discuss this when I get back. You are a large creature, and you need up. estrogen pumping no, through no, your I system at right. certain times to keep the blood flowing. I understand that. Kika, I, I'm going to need you to stop talking. Thank you. There is no need for the price to go up. I will not be long. You will all stay here and not put yourselves in danger. You won't have a pilot anyways, as I am leaving. Or we could have a pilot. We will rendezvous with. I need the. Oh, I need you know, the fighter. The here, fighter is on, Sarin. and the fighter is on Sarin. Not to slow yeah. your roll, but there are other people going for the same stuff you want. Like we don't have time to sit here and wait for you to come back from who knows where. You could always upgrade me to a full AI. I would be able to pilot the ship. That would be a very bad idea. That would be an expensive idea. Fine. We it, will. It might disrupt who you are. We will return to Sarin, <laughs> and I will take the fighter. Yes. Is yes. The what now? That yes. We will return to Sarin. I will take the fighter. Never mind. And I will return in a matter of a day or two. And we'll also return in a day or two with some new guns. Sounds good. No. You will stay on Sarin. <laughs> if you Then you to... won't get your guns. Wh when's the next time a pair of... When's a another of... ship gonna crash into a graveyard? I don't know. It just happens. She it's has not a point. planned. She has a point. We can't wait on this. Well, you're not going to have a pilot, and you're not going to have... This is an entire planet full of people. One of them knows how to fly a ship. You're not the only person that can fly this chunk. That was very rude of you. Sorry, Oksana. I fixed this ship. So you can fly it? No, but be nice. She is not incorrect, Captain. You could simply hire another pilot. And what? To fly my ship. Or yes. not get your guns. What's the worst that could happen? Or pay 1.5 million in guts. I mean, do you want to add failing the galaxy on top of being a shitty captain? <sighs> Fine. We will find you a pilot, and then we will return to Surin, and I will take the fighter to go help Pexy, and you will go to the graveyard. And then you will return alive and with our guns. That's the plan. So how do we find a pilot that we can trust? We just <laughs> find him and then pilot and then we take care of him afterwards. What? Alternatively, what? we pay someone whom the person we have already paid will trust. But that's half the party and then they can take over our ship. No offense, you're probably great. But you could disable Okay, okay, engines. like, I get that you have, like, an emotional attachment to this thing, but I don't want your ship. I have my own ship. I mean, it, in fairness, if someone was going to steal a ship, I don't think this would be the ship that they would steal. <laughs> I love it, but... <laughs> okay, then, then let's find a... I, we keep finding new people. Remember when it was just like three people and it was great and we broke the ship and then you found us and it was four great? Four people. Yes, and I remember four when people. you broke me and then mm -hmm. attempted to weasel your way onto the ship. So how could it possibly go wrong to bring someone we were, else on We board? together are one person, you know that. We share a bunk. 
No, you don't. She sleeps by the engine. <laughs> Y'all are weird. I'm going to go make a phone call. Please do. And get a pilot. And what with that, we shall end our episode for today. <laughs> You're not I wrong. I'm so sorry. I've been no. so mean to you. No. I'm so, so mean. Sorry. You're so mean. It's <laughs> fine. It's fine. Just call me like it's a fine. shitty pilot and say that I'm willing to sacrifice the whole of the galaxy <laughs> in order to go get the woman I love. That's fine. That's fine. No, I am. It's, it's not inaccurate, but you know, the second part, not the first part, but you know. <laughs> Oh my goodness, thank you so much everybody for watching. Uh, we are going to read out our donations that came, donations, donations that came in uh, in the second half, let you know where you can find us all next, and then we will sign off for the evening. Uh, so don't go anywhere while I hit reload on this page, and things reload. Can we I at first, roll my dice like, no. thankfully thank say thank you to Blue Jay for joining us. Thank you. Yeah. Lovely. Uh, you I can't know, get a 20. I Rachel Lucas is alive. Yay! Oh my god, it lights up. Yeah, yes. that's why. That's that like, is the cutest. Oh, we should show it to the camera while it's still going. Oh, yeah. Um, can we no. say... Oh, just oh. Really good I was like, what? what? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Who, like, yeah. are we talking about before a pilot gets to me? N no. Oh, is it going to be a surprise? It's a secret. It's a, it's probably a secret that will be revealed on social media. But how <laughs> soon? Like, how long do I have to keep it? Well, if you want to know the secret before everyone else, then you should sub on Patreon, where oh, it will shit. be announced mm -hmm. before mm -hmm. anywhere. Is that Maybe. on YouTube? <laughs> no. Um, <laughs> it should. Uh, we could, like, you could know early. I mean, know all the secrets if the you sub on show, Patreon. Yeah. <laughs> hit the Discord, though, because the Discord is where you get the up-to-date information. Sure, I'm pretty sure Yee. we can rely on our social media manager to uh, what? decide <laughs> when our social media manager I was just trying to help who... with suggestions. You know, it was a good, it was a good so one. I appreciate that. So on Patreon, get week. secrets. <laughs> secrets, all of the secrets. <laughs> I think I think our social media manager knows who's joining us next week, though. Who's, uh, who's <laughs> I don't know. It's a secret. It's a secret. Uh, it's a secret. Our it's first secret. donation that came through in the second half is from Paladin Hulk with five dollars and sixty nine cents. Quite well, team. I'm not ready to see another Leviathan player character go. Uh, then Chicago Mike, 1985, with four dollars and thirty one cents, and no message. Uh, we've had two. You wanna you wanna fill in this time, sir? Yeah, yeah. Um. Oh shoot. How does the song go? How does the Ica song go again? <laughs> we are the Ica, Ica, Ica flight boys. It's okay, Blue Jay. It's cool. It's, it's cool. Uh, Dan literally made it up on the spot. Nice. So, mm -hmm. um, yep. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, next is from Adam with thirty dollars. <laughs> Uh, that is what will happen when one of them gets space next week. I mean, wait, what? Uh, What's that mean? <laughs> wait a minute. Bean more loot this is why you should just stay on the ship. <laughs> Bean more loot with $20. Didn't plan to be up at 5 a.m., so we'll be watching to uh, 2 tomorrow, but wanted to pass on the ther on a thermal nuclear welcome to Blue Jay and send some space cuddles out into the void. Watch those pesky oh, Teslas. Oh, Sputtles. Uh, <laughs> Sputtles. 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 Watch those pesky Teslas, Teslas floating out there less than three. Oh yeah, I forgot about That's that. That's where you're going to get the weapons from. It's just a Now Tesla. even space <gasps> has traffic. Yeah, we were cool. And then uh, Nikki as... Try your best. Spell the word. Say it out loud N -I -C -I -A -S -T in your head. N-I-C-I-A-S-T. Us of... <laughs> Yep, that's Got a it. thing. With yeah, $15.33, you are the only one who has not provided a message for one that has not been sent. What is the message? The message is, Ziana is the best captain who has ever captained anything captain. that would captain. 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 Excepting for Picard. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. So Picard you. and yeah. Then Ziana. Yeah, and Ziana. Yeah, I was where that was uh, my sticking. Point. No, 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 no. no. Uh, our chaos in Nobody $10. Welcome to the crew, Blue Jay. I hope you enjoy Spuns. Space buns? Space yes. buns. Space, space buns. buns. Space, space buns. Oh. Uh, I haven't killed anyone yet. You did! You just killed an NPC today. I haven't killed a PC yet. Have you? Have I? You don't know yet. Uh, <laughs> and maybe you'll never know. Uh, <laughs> thank you so much, everybody, for watching. Uh, for
for supporting us for all of the donations that came through. Let us sign off uh, starting in the, with Lizzie. Where can we find you next? Hi, everybody. Uh, you can find me at Lizzie the Bold on the Twitches and the Twitters. You can also find me right here on Friday night at 7 p.m. where I am going to be playing a most dainty lady on it's the... very the opposite. <laughs> on uh, a manner of speaking, uh, a good society RPG based on the novels of Jane Austen. It's delightful. Uh, my name is Claudia, but I go by Jackie Dash on the Twitch and Twitter. J A K I D A S H. Someone dinged my. It was my job. Um, so, uh, if you're like, hey, where can I see Claudia do the entire range of her voice acting skills, which are zero? I'm like level. Actually, I'll give myself level two. I'm level two voice acting skills. Uh, I, uh, I'm going to be maybe finishing uh, Final Fantasy IX on Monday. Final <laughs> Fantasy IX on Monday. So hit me up 5.30 Pacific Standard Time on Jockey Dash. Twitch.tv slash Jockey Dash. It's great. Hi, guys. I'm Shell Game. You can... I'm Sarah. So you can find me on Twitch and Twitter at Shell Game. Yup. Have fun. <laughs> Doing great there. Good job. <laughs> Uh, I'm Blue Jay. You can find me at twitch.tv slash Blue Jay. Tomorrow you'll be able to find me playing Burning Wheel um, on twitch.tv slash Roll20, the number 20 app. And on Friday, um, playing Tomb of Annihilation, D&D 5e at twitch.tv slash D&D. Um, all the rest of the time, you can find me on Twitter at uh, twitter.com slash Blue Jay underscore 712. And I am Random Tuesday. You can find me on the internet as Random Tuesday. I'll be streaming on my own channel tomorrow morning. I think we're going to be making Admiral Holdo's dress. The fabric came in. Ooh. I'm very excited. Um, and then on Friday, I will be facilitating a matter of speaking at Jane Austen RPG. And then on Sunday, I will be GMing Avalon High School, a Monster Hearts Arthurian Legend alternate universe game. It's great. It's no one had cool. sex yet. But it's probably gonna happen. How is that possible? It's Monster Heart. They're they're it's actually going for a slow burn, and it makes oh, me very happy. I love slow, slow burns burn. are hard. We have a six week run, uh -huh. so I love slow. They can't burn. No, they can't blow your yeah. load. The episode longest, one. The longest Monster Hearts game I've ever done was two episodes. They tried. They tried. <laughs> so um, here's the thing. Like I am not a slow burn person. Like I'm an ignite it and like yay, it's hot. <laughs> <laughs> And with that, thank oh, I get you it. so <laughs> much, everybody, for joining us today. It has been truly a delight and a pleasure. We will see you on Friday. Have a great day-night cycle. Bye, everybody! <laughs>